Hey guys, I'm Nisha from nishahomey.com. Today I'm making a very simple and easy egg curry, which goes excellently with roti, chapati, puta, idiyappam, appam, or even bread. To make egg curry, I've heated a kadai and I'm adding in some coconut oil. Once the oil is heated, I'm adding in mustard seeds. Once the mustard seeds starts to splutter, I'm adding in broken Kashmiri chilies, fresh curry leaves, give this a nice stir. I'm adding in sliced onion and sliced green chilies. Give this a mix. Add in salt to taste. Adding salt to the onion helps to cook it faster. Now add in sliced ginger and garlic and mix very well. And allow the onion to turn transparent with the heat on medium. The onions have turned transparent. It has turned light pink in color but has not started to brown. So now let's simmer the fire adding in 1 teaspoon coriander powder, half teaspoon turmeric powder. Now give this a nice mix. Put the flame on low so that the masala does not get burned. Just mix this around for about 30 to 40 seconds. Add in sliced tomato. Give this a nice mix. Cover and cook the tomato for about 2 minutes. Let's open and check the tomatoes. Give it a nice mix. The tomato has cooked well. Just lightly mash it with a spoon. Add in 1 teaspoon vinegar. Give it a mix again. Add in 1.5 cups of coconut milk. If you are using coconut milk powder for one and a half cups you need about five tablespoon of coconut milk powder. Mix this really well. For this curry I am not using chili powder instead I am using green chilies. Green chilies you can increase or decrease according to your taste. Now add in one sliced tomato. Let's cover this and let it come to a boil on medium flame. Once it starts to boil, simmer the fire and let it simmer for about 3 to 5 minutes. This is a very mildly spiced egg curry. The gravy looks thick now. So I'm going to add in half teaspoon Kerala Garam Masala powder. The recipe is on the i card above. Give it a mix. Half teaspoon pepper powder, black pepper powder. Again, give this a mix. If you are in a hurry, you can always use coconut milk powder. To make coconut milk, just mix one and a half cups of water with. 5 tablespoon of coconut milk powder. The gravy looks thick and creamy. Now let's add in the boiled egg. Just give a small slit so that the gravy seeps inside the egg. You can also cut it into half and serve. 
some more curry leaves on top and there you go simple and easy egg curry is ready in just about 20 minutes if you like this recipe please give a thumbs up do subscribe to my channel for more video updates to try this recipe and let me know how this turned out thank you for watching bye bye